hi guys welcome if you haven't been to my channel and if you have welcome back and thank you thank you for those who were able to subscribe so we can learn about this natural hair thing together now i have an interesting video for you guys today but before i start i would like to wish you all a happy new year i wish nothing but success great health i wish you all meet your goals for the year so today i am going to do a hairstyle that i don't think i've ever done the hairstyle by itself if that makes sense and for some reason i don't really even have a good reason to why i've never done it it looks cute on everyone that do the hairstyle but for some reason i just kind of like skeptical to try it thinking like it's not gonna look good on me so it's a new year so i decided to try this hairstyle that i've been trying to stay away from so we are going to do con roll today yes i don't think i've done con roll by itself on my hair like ever Yes, I've done little cornrow on the side, just like that I did in the video, like this way, but I've never done cornrows front all the way back on my whole head. So that's what we're going to do. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more videos. And as you already know, so we can learn about this natural hair thing together. So I'm probably going to do like six cornrow or seven, depends on how it looks but I'm a little nervous um, am I the only one that haven't tried some like a hairstyle or something but think it's not going to look good with you know with you like same thing for outfits you may think it doesn't look good so you never actually give it a try so that's what I'm going to do I'm going to give Conroe like front to back a try so I'm going to part here all the way back it's going to be a little curve so since i'm doing seven it's going to be um medium size i would say oh that's gonna be interesting <laughs> and guys how was it new year's like did you guys have fun what did you do did you spend time with family loved ones I had a great um, New Year. I actually went to Atlanta for the first time and it was great. I went to the world of Coca-Cola. They have like multiple different like rooms to explore. One of the rooms have like six to seven like big fountain, but they don't like regular fountain, um, drink fountain. They actually, you know, like the little round, big round fountain. Um, and they have like different flavors from all over the world. It was amazing. Um, I tried, I tried, um, you know, from Italy, from Peru. My favorite drink, it was some type of like ginger ale, but it was not ginger ale, but it, it's made with ginger. I forgot the name of it. Tanza, something like that. And it's from Tanzania that was so good but that ginger is so strong like you could feel that in your throat if you have like a cold or something like this drink i feel like would probably like help in, like instead of a cup drop but it was great so we went to the world of coca-cola and then um on actually backtrack on our way to atlanta we stopped at the gas station I wouldn't be surprised if that's the biggest gas station in the world. Like it literally has over 100 pumps and it has probably like 20 um, pumps in addition to that for electrical cars. And inside of that store, literally it's like Publix, Walmart, like big it's huge and they have everything they might as well just i guess anyway it's so big you guys i'm going to try to post that post that this week um <clears throat> to make sure you guys take a look out for that because 
you'll get to see the inside of that thing. And we went to Helen. It's a very small town <clears throat> in uh, Georgia. We we did the roller coaster rides that's very popular there. It was scary, but we did that. And then I did a real zip lining. So I've zip lined before when I went to Mexico. Um, however, it wasn't that big of a zip line. I'm also going to post a short on that as well. It was scary. I'm not gonna lie. It was scary. I attempted to jump the first time I couldn't do it. I had to step down and let someone go before me. And then I, I'm just like, I mean, I have to go. If not, I have to wait. I don't know for how long for like the little um, cart to come back and pick me up from that mountain. But it was great. I'm glad I did it. But it was scary. So I did that. And then um, what, what else did we do? Oh, and then we went to um, a New Year's Eve party which was uh, very nice. Everything was inclusive, drinks, um, you know, food. They had a lot of food, which was great. Um, what else did we do? Um, we ate a lot, like every day um, for lunch, dinner, all we had was soul food. The uh, lovely lady that was, um, you know, serving us, she gave us some cornbread to dip in a little um, soup, but the soup is collard green, is the collard green water. I guess they boil the collard green for something else and then they take that soup, that little water, you dip the cornbread on it. I'm not gonna lie, it was great. Um, I actually drink the collard green water and um, eat the, uh, the cornbread separate, but um, yeah, it was nice. All right, guys, I think two corn rolls down. Um, I don't know how I feel about it yet. We'll see the final look. Um, but yeah, don't forget to like this video, guys, and if you can subscribe. Ooh. I have tender scalp. But I feel like for me, for this hairstyle to do that on my hair, it has to be, it cannot be too loose. Um, maybe that's also another reason why I haven't done it. Cause it has to be like, not too tight, but it has to be, you know, firm. So it doesn't, you know, <laughs> um, get messed up. Look at my face. I don't know, guys. Uh. Okay. Okay. My hair is so thick. And guys, let me know in the comment what are some hairstyles that you would love to try but a little skeptical or think you won't look good in. And let me know what are some hairstyles you think would look good on me. And we'll see if I can recreate some of those. So if you guys 
or busy, you love your natural hair, you don't really have, you know, time to do anything, you know, extreme, this channel is for you. We are learning about this together. So don't forget to subscribe and I look forward to see you guys on the next video in the next video after that. So let's finish the last one and then I have to twix and do some edges and do something with it because I'm still not feeling it yet. But yeah, let's do that. If you guys know, I think that's a sign to do my sideburn. If you watch my other videos, you know I always do the sideburn. So look at that. That was unintentional. Look at that. I guess that's the how it's looking. Um from that side it's cute. I don't know let's fix this as you know I like to use this to define my sideburn curls okay now I'm going to see what I can do with the edges I'm not an expert with my with edges I just do what I do as long as you know long as it looks cute and yeah this is the final look it's cute it's all right Let me see if I add a little accessory to it. If it's gonna look nice. Okay. That's helping. Not my favorite, but on me, but it's cute. But yeah, that is all. See you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.